All right, here it is, the BMW XM. This is no longer the concept car version. This is the actual production version. That means that you'll be able to buy this car. Of course, if you can afford it or if you can pay for it, but this is no longer just a tease. This is the final actual BMW XM. Oh, yes. You guys know that I'm a BMW SUV fan and this is the ultimate SUV by BMW. All right, so let's go step by step. Let's start off with the front, right? You have these LEDs in the shapes of like little daggers, you see? But the real lights are hidden underneath. Those are your headlights, your low beams, your high beams. And what's also cool is that on the grill, you now have horizontal kidney grills. You see the stripes right there? And you have them glowing. So you have a kind of a contouring glow around the grill. And then on top of that, you have a gold trim as well. Just to give it a little bit of extra oomph, you know? Uh, anyways, let's go over to the side. So, wheels designed specifically for this car. These are gold. They have a little bit of aerodynamic vents going on. This is completely wrong. These are actually going to be weighted, but right now uh, the ones that they have at the moment are stuck. I think that's because in Germany the weighted centerpiece is illegal. So they actually can't have it here, but in the rest of the world you will have it. All right, again, this gold trim on the side pays tribute to the original M1. The first M car ever built had a black line going through it, so they put a gold one to pay tribute to it, and I think it looks freaking sick. Same goes for this underside right here, this black stripe. And then these are the competition style side view mirrors. You see they're aerodynamic. They have the signature competition style kind of hole through them. Take a look. Look at the door handles. You see the prism shape? Super cool. By the way, it is raining outside, I am wet, so make sure you like the video and subscribe to the channel because we're making elite content. Daytime, nighttime, rain or shine. Lights, again. You have these, uh, look at that, whoosh, whoosh, kind of dancing around. LED tail lights, I love this. These look like shark gills or something, super aggressive. When you see this thing driving, especially from a distance. I mean, yeah, look at this angle, look at that. That looks freaking sick. Okay, so, the juicy stuff, what do we see? Vertically stacked exhaust pipes. Now, I don't wanna to refer to myself as somewhat of a pioneer, but I'm just saying, you know who brought this to the game? On an SUV? I was talking with BMW earlier and they're like, we did a world's first. We put vertically stacked exhaust pipes on a BMW and have a little brake light in the middle. I was like, okay. My favorite part of the entire car is definitely the back because of the vertical exhaust. Yeah. Uh, and then here you have this little uh, Formula One style oh, brake light. Oh, that's pretty So cool. when I slam on the brakes, these little guys will turn on oh, as well. Oh, cool. These are the vertically stacked exhaust pipes. They have an electronically controlled flap inside to control the noise, the sound, depending on your sport mode. You also have this gold trim right above the rear diffuser. You just have so many different textures going on. XM, outlight in gold. So they're actually gonna have a BMW red label and that's gonna be the most powerful BMW XM in the world. This right here has 650 horsepower. The red label is gonna have 750 horsepower. You're also gonna see that this has no BMW logo. Instead, it has them up here. And that's again to pay tribute to the original M car. Let's take a look at the inside because any of you guys who saw the original concept car, you remember that it had like a rock and roll theme kind of lounge, you know, like kind of brown, scratched up leather. It looked a bit funky, but this is the actual production that you're gonna get. So there it is, take a look. Again, very luxurious. You still have the brown leather as an option, you see? And what's pretty cool is look at the roof. You have that prism triangulated kind of texture. Also, because this is a luxurious car, you got pillows. Oh yeah, squishy pillows. This is the first original M car since the M1, the original M1. So they designed this thing for sport. You'll see the seat belt has the M trim on it. And you're gonna see BMW competition features everywhere. All right, so coming inside, first thing you'll notice, XM 
glows up and now look you can see everything light up how cool is this roof man this is awesome the first thing you'll notice is that you have this curved display this is 12.1 inches here 14.2 inches there uh, this is your infotainment this is your gauge clusters obviously it's surrounded by this kind of carbon fiber obviously that's just one of the options that you can get and as a bmw x6 driver this actually looks pretty familiar to me of course this has changed but they haven't done that much to this in fact i think this is actually just straight out of the x6 x5 competition the vents have changed though this is pretty interesting looks more aggressive you have like this little strip of ambient lighting there very short it doesn't cut through the front anymore it's just kind of like use here then it gets interrupted by the leather and then continues in the in the ac vents start stop button right there all right so that sound is actually made by hans zimmer he actually was in charge of making different sounds for this car and for different bmws in general but that's pretty cool you can actually just keep on playing with that listen pretty cool a couple of things here we have the m mode of course we can put everything into m mode this is a 4.4 liter twin turbo v8 and it's a hybrid so actually when you go to your different modes you can actually see you have m hybrid mode when you go to m hybrid you have hybrid electric or e-control and when you go to electric mode you can go up to 140 kilometers an hour straight on electric you can travel up to 88 kilometers on this mode fully electric so look, so what's also pretty cool is if I go into my menu, when I press sport mode, everything's going to turn red. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. Check out the roof. That's sick. Look, other competition features when you close the door, you'll see that you also have ambient lighting in the speaker as well that lights up. Always a nice feature. Also, your door handles have ambient lighting. And this car is going to start at about $170,000. Now, unfortunately, they do not let me drive this because it's so, so early, so early. And in Germany, can't drive it. Maybe next time, though. What do you guys think? Let me know. Do you like it? I personally love it. When I saw it in person, I thought it looked incredible. So like the video, subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys next time.